If you cherish the thought of voyaging across the vast expanse of the world's various oceans, then you can be sure of one thing in particular. And that is that you are going to encounter some rough weather. Heading back to port is not always possible and staying in a harbour for several days until the storm passes is often not a viable option. So if you want to travel the world in your own yacht, not only are you going to want to do this in complete luxury, but you will also want to do it in a vessel that will not let you down when, not if, the weather turns bad. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the beautiful Bering 80, a steel hulled expedition yacht that can take you to places which you have only ever probably seen on the Discovery Channel. Not only will the Bering 80 take you and your family and friends to the far reaching, idyllic and beautiful untouched spots around the world in complete luxury, but she will also look after you should the weather start to deteriorate. I am a massive fan of ocean going, expedition and explorer yachts. And I love Bering's range of yachts, not only for their exquisite opulence, but also for their outstanding lines and curves. When you look at the side profile of these explorer yachts, then they look similar to the sort of vessel that you would see braving false 12 gals in the Bering Sea. And the namesake of this yacht builder is no coincidence. When a yacht builder names their vessels after one of the most challenging seas on the face of the planet, then you just know that their vessels are going to be extremely capable. For me, an ocean-going explorer yacht needs to convince the eye, without even stepping on board, that it will be able to take you and your family through some truly gnarly conditions. And with the Bering 80, this ability to gain your trust just by gazing upon her majestic lines is testament to her seagoing capabilities. If you asked me, as someone who has served in the Royal Navy and RNLI, to take a motor yacht into weather conditions which would make most seafarers not want to leave the dock, then the Bering 80 would be at the top of my list. She is, quite frankly, a masterpiece of naval architecture and naval engineering. While you are here, then please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel as I continue to bring you videos like this one following my 30 year love affair with yachts boats and the sea. You can also find me on Instagram as well, so next time you're on there why not give me a follow. And finally, it would mean a lot to me if you could follow me on Facebook as well. I know, that's a lot of follow requests, right? But it means that I can carry on bringing you these sort of videos, so if you do follow me, then thanks.